Hello and welcome back to the channel. It's Echo Stretch here. In this video, we're going to check out uh, Carol's host. Um, I thought we'd uh, check out Hen 2.1.3b. Um, we're used to using Gold gold Hen and we never actually use that there. And I always see it there and I'm always meaning to give it a try and give it a go. I never actually tried it before, so it'd be interesting just to see how well it works. And uh, yeah, so let's give it a go. So we can jump over to settings. Uh, you can see I do not have debug settings. Uh, we'll go up and enable the internet. There we go. I was already on there. Um, I did launch it there once. I wanted to see if uh, see how well it worked, and uh, I didn't go into the settings or anything to see anything. Uh, I just actually launched it to the payload, and uh, it went pretty quick with no errors. So. Just go ahead and clear all this. Uh, we'll go to our bookmarks and we're going to scroll down to Caro's host here. Okay, and we'll just go with the 7.55a. And we'll give that a few moments here just to get the cache installed. Shouldn't take too long. So when I noticed it, uh, I was going in to just do a normal jailbreak there, and, and I noticed it there, and it, I thought I'd give it a go just for, and it, everything worked out fine. I did notice that uh, rest mode was fixed. Um, I guess that might have been an issue before maybe rest mode wasn't working with it. So we'll give rest mode a, a, a test with it as well. Uh, I want to give Orbis Toolbox a test as well, see if that actually launches with it too. I'm assuming every, everything should be pretty much the same. It's just that uh, there might be a few different tweaks between Gold Hen and then the Hen. But uh, we'll give it a go and see how well it works. Okay, there's our 100%. So we can go ahead and turn off the internet to and reopen to run the, the exploit. Okay, and we'll go in. Uh, previously, I think it was two memory errors, and I got in. So hopefully, it's the same around around the same number, but we'll see. Okay, so there's one. Okay, so we're going in there even earlier than last time. Everything's loading good. Okay, so we have to do the jailbreak now. We're just going to go with the, the latest jailbreak. Um, so we'll go ahead and launch that. Run a new jailbreak. Please wait. Should only take a few seconds and we'll know if we got in or not. Okay, so jailbreak is complete. Now we can run the payload. So we're used to running gold hen 1.1, 1 .1, uh, but we're going to give this hen 2.13b a go. Um, it says spoof to 9.99. Nine, nine it fixes rest mode by Cairo. Fixes for all firmware, all 7.5 firmware, I should say. Uh, so we'll go ahead and give it a launch, and we'll see if it, everything goes through good. There we go, waiting for clients. Launch and payload. And there we go, uh, 2.1.3b by Carol. So let's go ahead and load uh, Orbis's toolbox as well, just to see if, uh, see if we can get this to work on it as well. Um, no. Okay, so I don't know if, uh, yeah, I'm not sure if that's a Gold Hen. I think I, I tried this before even with Gold Hen 1.1 and the toolbox didn't load. I'm not sure. I will come back in again and try it just to see. But, uh, okay, yeah, let's just exit out and, uh, while we're here, we can check out, uh, just to see if something else will load, we'll load WebRTE, just to see if we, uh, see if we can get something to load. Okay, waiting for payloads, or payload, launching the payload. 
There we go, PS4 trainers loaded. No issues there. Uh, we can try another one here as well, just to be just to be sure. I find it odd that we didn't get the, the message waiting for payload. So we'll go ahead and hit FTP. Waiting for payload. Launch a payload. Run an FTP server. Unable to get IP address, but that's normal because we're disconnected from the internet. Uh, we're just testing to see if uh, see if other things work as well. Okay, we're gonna load one more, just PS4 debug, and we'll just see if that'll load as well. Okay, waiting for payload. Launching payload. Okay, I'm not sure it. It might have not launched it due to WebRTE, but uh, yeah. So let's go ahead. Uh, we can try it once more here just to see if it see if it comes up. But uh, yeah, I don't think it's going to come up. Okay, that's fine. Um, let me know in the comments below if you got it to load or if it's still giving you the same error. If you did try it with the Goldham 1.1. Uh, let me know as well if it loaded or if it didn't load. So let's just jump out and see if we have our debug settings. Okay, so we got our debug settings. Everything is good there. Let's launch a game and then we'll jump into rest mode and see if uh, see if everything stays where it should. So we'll just give this a couple of moments here just to load in. And then we'll go from there. So once we get into the main uh, the main menu, we'll go ahead and jump into rest mode and see if we can come back with everything loaded. Okay, so we'll go ahead and hit our PlayStation button, and we'll go over to power, power options, and we'll go into rest mode. We'll give this a few moments. Uh, shouldn't take too long to go into rest mode, but uh, there is a game loaded, so it will take longer than usual. So I still have the the pulse in uh, blue light. Okay, it looks like we're going orange, and it's pulsing. Once it goes solid, uh, we'll go ahead and turn it on. I'm going to turn it on from the controller, not the PlayStation, just to make sure that... Uh, we are very able to do it from the controller. Okay, and uh, by the looks of it, uh, the PlayStation just turned off. It didn't go into rest mode at all. So we're going to go ahead and hit the PlayStation button. Okay. So I hit the PlayStation button. It's not communicating with the PlayStation. So we're going to go ahead and hit the uh, the button on the PlayStation. Okay, so it did, I believe it did do a kernel panic because I hit the, the button on the PlayStation. No lights it on at all. So I'm going to have to hit it again in order for it to turn on. And there we go. It's turning on now. Uh, we'll probably get a hard drive scan for sure. Give it a few moments here, and we will see what happens. Okay, so there's a hard drive scan. I'm going to leave the video at that there. I'm going to try it once more here, um, and just see if it uh, see if anything happens. If I do post this video, if you do see this video, basically I tried it again, and all the errors came through. So if you enjoyed the video, like it, uh, subscribe if you're not subscribed. And if you guys had different outcomes of it, leave a comment down below and uh, let me know. And let me know what PlayStation you're using. I'm using one of the, the
the first PlayStation, so it may be, with a Pro, it might be a little better, or Slim, it might be better. But let me know. I'll see you guys in the next video.